All right, rusty tutorial. Let's get it. About to turn this nice BMW I got here to a rusty beater. Shit, let's get into it. Shit, make it like a like a brownish, orangish, orangish, reddish, tannish. Yeah. Then you hit that bucket right there. It's real important you do this. And then you just add that the other color over and you can see it already got the little glitchy parts in there. So it makes it look kind of rusty already. And since you kind of follow this pattern here, I'm going to show you. Ooh, the color going to go like a dark gray. Ain't too bad. So this vinyl right here, this is the most important one. It's the one you finna be reusing a lot. You want to make it kind of brownish, tannish, the same color as the undercolor was before you put that bucket paint on there. And then it's real important that you make it like a little bit invisible. You see, I'm finna turn the thing down to like a 0.8. That way, when you double lap them or you overlap them, like it look, it add the rusty effect. It just, I don't really know how to explain it. You'll see when I'm done. Now. When it's coming to it, nigga, no, I do this. Call me young next, nigga. I'm the coolest, nigga. I'll be flowing when it comes to shooting, niggas. Hammers and tools, nigga. Who we hitting? Nigga, we ain't missing. Fuck that ammunition. See a nigga lacking. Pop his ass with distance. Pop that nigga risky. Then I hop in my whip and I get the drifting, bitch. I'm gone. When it's coming to it, nigga. So I just no, been I adding some rust on next, there, you know, I'm doing the, the overlapping nigga, thing. With the opacity, you know, it's starting to come out pretty good. And I'm just doing the same thing here. You see, I'm following that, those lines right there, those glitchy lines. I'm just kind of following those with that same vinyl. And I'm just making it work. And it's coming along pretty good, as you can see. And then, so the quarter panels on a lot of cars, they get rusty and they get replaced. So what I'm finna do, we just add like a little square here. And it'll just add like like a rusty aesthetic to it you know what i'm saying that look pretty good and when you're doing the rust you don't want each side of the car to look the exact same you want them to look different you know what i'm saying so that's that's what's gonna help with this too So after this, you want to go back to that bucket layer once you got all your rust spots and, you know, a lot of your rust scratches. And then mess with the opacity of that. That's what I'm going to do here. And you're going to see it's going to kind of change the effect. See, because the under, the under part of the car was brown. So when you're making it a little bit invisible and you're changing the opacity, it makes it look as that rust effect. But you see, I'm going to change the color because my brighter, warmer colors look a little better now the rust is blending in. Yeah, see this orange right here? Fire. Fire, boy. I think we finna stick with this one right here. And then just finna add some more rust spots just to check it out. Add some more detail on there. On a lot of old and rundown cars, the windows will look a little foggy and dirty and a little dusty. So that's what I'm doing right here. Just making them look a little more dirty, I guess. Making that effect look a little cool. She found that nice brown. And normally what I like to do, I like to take the middle, the middle windows away. Like they roll down or something. And then after that, you can add a little bit more details. You know, I'm just adding some more details to the hood. Seeing how it will blend and everything. After the hood, you can edit the roof of the car. Because, you know, they get a little rusty up there from rain. So they just been sitting or something. They ain't had nothing on them. And you want to add that cool effect on there. you spawn a nice car and mad out someone always blows it up just for no reason or they just steal it you can't even park it without it getting stolen or blown up or shot up so that's where these rusty cars come in handy and plus a lot of people do love them i be getting a lot of compliments on my cars oh yeah <laughs> this is the car yeah, nigga that maybach nigga
Go to car. Yeah. Yo, you see how they hyping it up? It's all about how you roll with it. This shit my heart is here, boy. Come here, come on here. My car. Hey, come over here real quick. All you brother, the, the keys is in the ignition. And after all that, this is what you get, man. I took the windows out of mine to make it look like it ain't come with windows, and I put different type of rims on there. You know, the rusty ones. And this is what you get, man. After rusting out the roof, the little quarter panel added some rust spots on the side. Checking out the back. You know that's kind of fire. You know that's kind of fire. And then this is this the first one I built right here. And shout out to my boy Flame, man. Without him, I wouldn't have made this video, man. Yeah, heavily requested for sure. Just the one. Look at that. And that's how you get rusty cars in Meadow.